It's called the bowl text effect. Let's make it. Select the type tool, then type pinky, and we're going to change the font to Kelsey. This is Kelsey one field font. I dropped the font download link in the description so you can go download it. Hold Ctrl and press the right arrow to add the letter spacing. I'm going to right click, create outline, right click, ungroup, and double click to isolate it, then delete the extra part. Press ESC key to go back to normal. Now I'll show you how to distort and customize this. I grab the pencil tool or press N to pick it fast. All you need to do is drag from one side of the path to create an extension like this, shaping your text exactly how you want. Grab the Esmos tool to soften the line. Move the letters, arrange them your way, and done. Alright, I select everything, press Ctrl G to group it, and then change the fill color to pink. And let's go to the effect 3D and materials and click on inflate. You also get the panel setting right here. Just follow along and make the same adjustments I'm doing. Play around with the values a bit and see what you like best. Activate the shadows and click on the ray tracing. And this is how you create this graffiti bubble text effect here in Illustrator. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and check out more videos on the channel.